Hello and a very warm welcome. My name is Danielle Collins. I'm the world leading face yoga expert and I love sharing wellness techniques for you and natural beauty tips. Now, something I am asked about a lot is the nose area. Now, you may know I've done a few YouTube videos on the nose area before, just explaining a little bit about the nose. But today I'm going to show you a few new techniques and we're going to talk about what we can do when it comes to toning the nose and what we can't do. So when it comes to the nose, we do have some muscles which surround the nose. We have the nasalis muscle here. We also have a muscle which runs down here, another one which runs down here. But we've got this whole area here, which is just cartilage. We've got our nasal bone here, and then you've got a bone up inside there. So it's not like other areas of the face where we have these facial muscles which we can tone up and that we can tone up quite quickly. When it comes to the nose, you can tone some of these surrounding muscles. It does take a little longer to see results if you're wanting to tone or shape the nose a little bit, but it's definitely worth keeping those up. Our nose does change as we age. So if we're doing techniques which are going to help to tone this whole area and tone this area, it's going to help the nose to look a lot more in shape. So this definitely is one of those videos that you may find out there on the internet, which is about instantly slimming your nose or instantly shaping your nose, because it's not about that. It's a much more realistic video that's about long term. So keeping the techniques up regularly to tone those muscles and it will also keep the cartilage around this area nice and healthy too so all of that is just going to help your face appear better but also help overall wellness too so our first technique which is a super traditional yoga technique but it's very good for calming the mind but it also just helps the cartilage of the nose stay nice and healthy and it slightly exercises the muscle here too so it's our alternate nostril breathing so we're going to join in now making sure you've got clean hands and you can place two fingers here just between your eyebrows. So then you can use one finger and the other finger and we're going to use these as alternate nostrils. So we're going to do breathing. Now, if you're very used to this technique, you can do that, but I am going to show you it with the thumb and the index finger. So if we use the thumb and index finger, what this is going to do is just allow you to see it a little bit easier on the video. But if you know the traditional way, do the traditional way. So we're going to take one nostril, cover it with our thumb, inhale through the nose, pause, hold, then release as you exhale. Inhale through this nostril, pause for two seconds, release the finger, exhale. Inhale through the nose, pause, release. Inhale, pause, exhale. Inhale, pause, exhale. Again, inhale, pause, exhale. Inhale, pause, exhale. And you can do this in your own time for up to about one minute. It's really great for helping to reduce stress and anxiety too. So our next technique, we're just going to take the two index fingers and just come just a little point above the nostrils there and you're going to press into that point. Now you're going to start to flare and release your nostrils against the resistance of the fingers. Now this is starting to tone your nasalis muscle. So we're going to do that for about a minute together now. So you can see here how I'm doing it. I'm just come a bit closer just to show you. Flare and release against that resistance. A little bit longer now. Keep flaring and releasing. Keep breathing as you do this. Just keep that going for a bit longer. Remember to stop if it ever makes you feel dizzy. Sometimes these nose techniques can do that. So it's super important to stop if you need to. Okay, so once you've done your one minute relax, then we're going to take the tip of our finger 
just here on our nose. And we're going to breathe and we're going to hold this position. Now we're going to start to press the nose downward slightly. And as we put a little bit of pressure there, keep breathing, keep focusing on that slightly downward motion. This is really helping that cartilage of the nose to stay nice and healthy and really going to help this area stay a lot more defined. So let's hold there. Again, you can do this when you're doing this yourself for about one minute. Let's take a few deep breaths in through the nose and out through the nose. And again, in through the nose and out through the nose. So after about one minute, bring the hand down. So our final technique for the nose area is one which is recommended a lot by plastic surgeons after their patients have had rhinoplasty, so once they've had a nose job. And it really just helps this whole area become healthier, it helps recovery, but if you're using this not from a recovery point of view, but because you want your nose area to look nice and toned, it's wonderful for helping to boost circulation, keep the cartilage nice and healthy, but also just keep tone in those muscles. So you're going to take index finger and thumb and just slide down. So again, let me come a bit closer just to show you that slide and release here, just on the bridge of the nose, up and down, sliding. Use your breath. Again, they can make you feel a little bit dizzy, these, so really do take it to your own level and keep that focus on the breath. Then we're gonna come a bit further down, so hopefully you can see how I'm going there, up and down on that part of the nose. Focus on your breath again, in through the nose and out through the nose. So all of these techniques, one minute each, and you're doing them daily. And then gently come back down. So I hope that video has been useful for you. If it has, please give it a little thumbs up like if you're watching this on YouTube. And don't forget to click subscribe and the little bell to get notified as well, because this will allow you to know when I upload new videos, which I do very regularly. And if you'd like more information on face yoga, then go to faceyogaexpert.com. Have a wonderful day. Take care. Bye bye. Yeah.